So welcome you everyone. Now today we have a next bit of the topic is a magnetic properties of d block elements. So we know in a basic concept of a solid state friends magnetic properties of various types paramagnetic diamagnetic ferromagnetic antiferromagnetic and antiferrimagnetic the magnetic properties are various the in that category yes we have in a two very major part is a magnetic properties is a two major part one is paramagnetism and another one is diamagnetism this what are paramagnetic materials and uh, diamagnetic paramagnetic and diamagnetic as yes, we know the simple definition what are paramagnets this yes, you uh, use a substance or you keep in a substance in a magnetic field if the magnetic field is undergoes is a repulsion will be takes place the substance you keep under the magnetic field and the component is or this magnetic field is undergoes a repulsion and this is known as a paramagnetic yes you kept a substance in the magnetic field if that magnetic field is undergoes attracts those substances are called diamagnets paramagnetic substance undergoes a repulsions the diamagnets are ever attraction why it undergoes a repulsion this repulsion is completely depend upon number of unpaired electrons due to the number of unpaired electrons the paramagnetic behavior will be shows and diamagnetic means due to the paired electrons artha madkore makale magnetic substance anna now magnetic field alli ittaga adu yenadru repulsion adu double start madko andre adu paramagnetic adu yaak repulsion aagutade andre alli unpaired electron gal irutade the substance is kept under the magnetic field magnetic field alli substance anna aagidaga attract aagak start aitu antandre sir adu diamagnetic karana yes those metal or the component having a paired electrons a simple question nim kelbodu yes why the d block elements shows paramagnetic in nature or why the transition metals are paramagnetic one minute because nam start a helide nimge the every answer is single because of unpaired electron yes paramagnetic due to the unpaired electron diamagnetic due to the paired electron yes this is the basic yes based on this we have a calculation of magnetic moment this kind of magnetic moment that we calculate madlikke bartade so how to calculate the magnetic moment is a very important magnetic moment yes it is represented as a symbol is mu s mu is equal to square root of n into n plus this is your formula s with having an unit is a bm bm stands for bohr magneton bohr magneton what it indicates n n stands for number of unpaired electrons there am okay how to calculate the magnetic moment formula in put very magnetic moment is equal or nothing but is a mu is equal to square root of n into n plus 2 we keep in your form n into n plus 2 yes unit is bm the full form is bohr magneton n stands for number of unpaired electrons this is very simple help to calculation of magnetic moment values yes if you get the zero magnetic moments mu value zero bond bidtu andre keep in your mind those are diamagnets if i have a certain value when this yen adru value bantu andre compound yen antu now paramagnetic agar values bandre paramagnet zero bandre diamagnet okay how to calculate sir in question kelida so many times they asked the question question number 24a yes calculate calculate mu value or magnetic moment value of copper plus 3 question for clear marks calculate the mu value of chromium plus 3 very simple how to know to calculate this chromium plus three. before to plus 3 we know the electronic configuration of chromium friends atomic number 24 yes electronic configuration argon 3d and 4s chromium is special case yes this is a 3d5 and 4s1 this is your electron distribution 
one, two, three, four, five. Six electrons. Okay, yes, what about chromium plus three? Now, oxidation state can be done plus three. Plus three means loss of three electrons. The chromium is the more electron. Now, take it now. Take the gitti ra. Yes, argon, three D. ओके पा मूर इलेक्ट्रॉन तेज मतलब फर्स्ट आउटरमोस्ट में तेज इतना है सर आउटरमोस्ट वन दी दे वो की दे रहे जीरो यू हैव फाइव आई दी दे ये वन दो की दे नहीं रहते ये लोग सर अगर ये थ्री डी थ्री सो नाउ ये हैव वन टू थ्री यस देर इज नो इलेक्ट्रॉन इन इस वन दर सो इट मींस एल इज इक्वल � अस्ट इलेक्ट्रॉन माइनस स्टार्ट विथ ऊटर मोस्ट ये प्लस एस्ट बरदाने ये इलेक्ट्रॉन माइनस बरी बॉक्स हाकोरी कैन गेट इट एन इफ गेट एन व्याल्यू कैन ईजी क्यालक्युलेट म्यू इज ईक्वल टू ये कैन यूज म्यू इज ईक्वल टू स्क्वे रूट आफ एन इंटू एन प्लस टू स्क्वे रूट आफ एन इंटू एन प्लस टू यस एन इज थ्री कैन यूज थ्री Yes, this is a three plus two. Careful, I'm adding up there. Mu. Yes, mu is equal to three plus two is a five. Five three is a fifteen. Root fifteen. Yes, what about the root fifteen value? Yes, you can calculate with the help of calculator. You must a simple calculator today. Yes, as I know, this is the value of what? Chromium plus three. What is the magnetic moment value? Magnetic moment value of chromium is 3.73. If you get the fraction or you get the result, the compound is para. You know, this is a para magnet. How to know my para magnet? Because sir, we have three n pair. Due to three n pair, it is an para. If there is no n pair electron, it is a para magnet. This is a simple calculation of our syllabus. Magnetic moment. It's a formula of mu, square root of n into n plus 2. Symbol is notation unit is a Bohr magnet on. Calculate element number four. This is a very simple one to calculate the chromium. If you want another one, yes, we can take another example. So, with the help of this, you can calculate anything else. You must calculate more. I will show you another element mentioned. In our syllabus, there is iron plus. Same question. Calculate the mu value of iron plus. How to start? First, iron atomic number twenty six. Scandium, titanium, vanadium, chromium, manganese, iron twenty six. As electronic configuration, argon twenty six. For s, eighteen, twenty, twenty six. Okay, fine. Okay. How do we read the box? One, two, three, four, five. This is a pair. No, it's two here. This is what about ionic form? If it plus two, plus two under loss of two electron. Here under electron, what do you mean? Yes, sir. Under there, argon, three d and four s plus two here. Then no problem. Zero. This is as usual. Same. Six. Okay. Six stands for. So one, two, three, four, five. This is six. Yes, sir. You have the electron. You can count one, two, three, four. Again, therefore, n is equal to four. Four stands for it is a paramagnet. Paramagnetic. Yes, based on four, you can calculate the mu. Mu is equal to okay. Yes, square root of n into n plus two. So mu is equal to square root of n four. Four plus two, simple. Mu is equal to four plus two, six. Huh? Twenty-four. Four plus two, six. Six plus two, twenty-four. Yes, the value is four point nine zero four. This is easy to tell. Sir, yes, sir. You better get it. I know the values. So this is a four point nine zero four meter. So this is a simple method to calculate your component. If you want to practice. And apart from this, how can I practice? So you can practice the example of Fe plus three, scandium plus two. Okay, you use chromium plus two. Okay, and then you can use copper plus one. 
कॉपर प्लस टू जिंक फ्लोर स्पेशली जिंक प्लस टू ओके कैन आई यूज दिस वन कैन आई यूज दिस वन ओके यस है एग्जाम ओके वन सेकेंड से वेरी सिंपल कैन यूज द कैलकुलेशन ऑफ जेड एन प्लस फास्ट यस जिंक एटॉमिक नंबर थर्टी आर्कॉन ओके डू इट फास्ट थ्री डी टेन एंड फोर एस टू डी ऑर्बिटल इज टेन इज डायरेक्टली आई विल यूज जेड एन प्लस टू मीन्स लॉस ऑफ टू इलेक्ट्रॉन्स आर्कॉन थ्री डी टेन एंड फोर एस जीरो कैन यूज अ बॉक्स वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन Yes, there is no unpaired electron. Therefore, n equal to zero. If n equal to zero, the compound is diamond. Yes, there is no n. Mu is equal to square root of n into n plus two. Yes, mu is equal to zero zero plus two. We have the zero value. Automatically, the compound is diamagnetic. Yes, you can keep practicing with different elements with magnetic moment. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Let's keep practicing, friends. We will meet in the next video with the colors and thank you, thank you.